Hi everyone, this is Cherie. I'm a design team member for 12 by 12 cardstock shop. And today I'm just gonna do a quick tutorial on how to ombre a flower. I use sugar and spice and lemonade for the color of the pink and yellow. And I got the SVG for the flower from Marjorie Ann Designs, Franklin's Bug Hunt. There are several different um, SVGs that I will be using throughout different videos, but this one is just the flower for this video. So what I did is I have Tim Holtz Distress Oxide inks, Festive Berries is my darker one, and Picked Raspberry is my lighter. And then for the center yellow, we're going to use Catherine Pooler's Glitz Color. So I'm going to take the Picked Raspberry and I'm gonna go just in a little over half because we're gonna go over the outer edges uh, with a darker color, but we wanna pull some of that pink in and saturate it on the outer edges and only about halfway down the middle. And that's because we do want it to fade into the lighter sugar and spice pink of the paper towards the middle. So I don't wipe that up yet. I work on a glass mat just so I can wipe it up when I'm done. It's a lot easier for cleaning care. So this is now the festive berry. If I could quit dropping my glue there. And all I'm doing is I did not clean up the lighter pink. I stayed in it with the festive berry. That way I then just drag both of the colors along the edges. And that's what's going to give the darker tips. And that's all for this one. The flower is done, so we'll go ahead and cover those. And now I use a finger dauber to apply the ink on the middle. which goes by simple, simply easy and quick. And then I will just glue on the center and the flower is finished. If you have any questions, let us know. I will be more than happy to help. I love different inking techniques, but there's the finished product. Have a good day, guys.